kill it. Yeah, well, you well once you, if you have a berserker with you, strikes aren't a problem because all you can do is just um, all you have to do is just keep hitting them with the melee weapon, and they just stand there like a dumbass. That magma is hard to get out. Look at all these bugs. Oh, all the bugs? That means you have a plague, and you're about to die. Holy shit, that was close. Oh, by the way, uh, Timex, if, if your medic has the MP7, get him to equip the MP7 medication dot. Multi-kill. Automatically on the medic gun. The wait, what? A medic MP7 the medic medication dot. He's already on the gun and I didn't die from the plague. How do you feel? Hey, free runner. Wait, Damn don't you. kill me. Free runner. Uh, AFK. What are your stats and speed? Fuck you. Just sitting there. When Bill see, sees your character, does he yell tank? Wait, what? I'm just standing here, right next to the door. No one's killing me. No one's doing the damn thing. That's the power of the cloak. Wait, how... Safe. I have level 5... Level 5 speed. How fast will Al... Dude, I can even chill in a dumpster. You're a terrible person. You're seriously a terrible person. Like, I... I should have never said anything. That was a complete dick move, you goddamn plague. Hey, time I'm going to play killing for him. For I'm peacing. Okay, I'll join you. Except my friend invite though, so I can join you. Alright, yeah. I skip servers a lot. But I'm just saying, I'm just warning you. When I play killing for, I skip servers a lot. And I also dislike voice communication a lot in Killing For. I feel like it ruins the whole atmosphere. Why is that? I don't know, it just doesn't fit. Like, you have people... Like, the game is so intense, and you got the music going, and just all this blood and gore everywhere. It's just beautiful. And then, like, you get someone on the vo on the mic. Like, here, there's no ambience. There's no nothing like that. You know, there's not... There's not a lot going for ambience. But, like, you oh, get true. into, uh... You get into Killing Floor and it's just, oh shit, I was nowhere near you. Anyhow, you get into Killing Floor and it's just like, <laughs> kill, kill, kill. And you're just like running around killing zombies, it's all intense and shit. And then someone gets on mic and you're like, oh, you're ruining it. I don't know why, I just feel that way. Yeah, I understand that, but what kind of game is that? Killing Floor is beautiful, that's what kind of game it is. It's like the, it's the greatest zombie killing game you're ever going to play. I'm not even exaggerating. That game is seriously a must-buy. Like, it's probably one of the best- It's probably my most played game on Steam. Oh my- Jesus, I killed him! Holy shit! Wait- Holy shit! We have music here as well, we just, uh, occasionally we won't- We won't turn it on, or whatever. Where's the music? Hell yeah! What the? Turn that shit back on! I wanna go... Yeah, there you go. Now let's turn on player versus monster and make a Mario map with all headcrabs. And then we're gonna be getting somewhere.
No, you're not actually <laughs> pretty amazing. Evil police, evil police, tell my fidelity to make a Mario game mode. Make a level like that. That's just in there. And everyone can well switch to that level. Everyone just runs, killing them. Shit would be amazing. And I know you use console commands to change the game mode. So all you need to do is use a point underscore server command to switch that shit around. That'd be beautiful. Okay, you know man, now you're ruining it. I'm making recommendations from a development and design point. and give it to you guys. I've been developing on the Source Engine for years. I'll just make it for you. You shout right at me. Now I know you didn't see me.